Hello everyone, Star here. Welcome to my video on Zaku, the Void Warframe. Zaku will be the 44th Warframe edition. With this, Zaku is also the weirdest design in not only abilities, but also looks. Zaku was designed to be a broken Warframe from the community event. Zaku is a void based Warframe that ultimately follows a similar system to Protea, Korra, Limbo, Chroma, and Titania. Now I know this sounds crazy, but it's true. First, his passive allows a chance to avoid damage from one source. Obviously this is helpful because you can just completely ignore one person's damage immediately, but also this is a chance, it's not guaranteed, and also there is no guaranteed chance whether or not you dash. Zaku's first ability infuses his weapons with void damage. I don't really think this is going to be that useful, especially because a lot of enemies aren't really that vulnerable to void damage. His second ability can open and close the void to disarm enemies with these weird tentacles in the real world. His third attack can be cycled. Two of them can stop enemies like Limbo's stun and the crowd control like Korra's thorns, and the last ability allows him to summon a turret near Automata style. Now, of course, the first two abilities are awesome. The Limbo stun focuses on one enemy that you can completely stun, and the crowd control automatically puts thorns around a bunch of enemies, just like Korra, I believe, but in the demo, it wasn't really shown that it works as a crowd control, but you can only guess that it kind of works the same way. And of course, the newest addition to a lot of these abilities is definitely the Protea turret style thing. It's supposed to be a fissure apparently, but it just looks more like a turret. And of course, his last ability allows him to explode some of his armor pieces and still have 75% damage reduction and evasion, and it also turns you into a skelly boy. Zaku is really weird when it comes to the demo DE made. They show off all of his different abilities, but we still don't know the numbers. The damage and survivability of Zaku that will really set him off as the broken Warframe, but clearly his cycle system and other abilities copy other Warframes, kind of like a weird Valkyrie of combined warframes. So that was my video on Zaku, the broken warframe. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell icon for more warframe content. Be sure to leave any questions or comments you may have in the comment section below, and I'll get to you guys there. This has been Star, signing off, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.